Borage oil, not borage seed oil. Now, you heard of omega-3s. Borage is actually rich in omega-6. Now, you want to say, I do. Now, you just told me, don't use omega-6. Yes, don't use a lot of omega-6 when you are inflamed, right? Well, borage oil has a cousin of omega-6 called GLA, gamma lanolytic acid. Okay, gamma lanolytic acid. Gamma lanolytic acid is not like your typical omega sixes. Okay, it's like it's like you know it's like your cousin who wants to hang with his big the big cousin the omega three. I want to be just like you, even though I'm I'm in this family right over here. Even though I'm with the the Wilsons, I want to be with the Johnsons. Okay, so he's a part of the Wilson group. The Wilsons are the omega six. The Johnson or the Omega-3, so he rolls more with the Omega, the Johnsons. He likes to hang around with the Johnsons. Yeah, that's my family over there. The Omega-6s are my family, but I like to roll with you Omega-3s over here, okay? Y'all doing something good. I like to. I want to figure out how you do what you do, and I want to copy it, and I want to be something like you. So board draw you has in there Omega-6 called GLA. It likes to copy somewhat. Of omega-3. It says, I don't want to be like my cousin, the Wilsons, over here. I don't want to cause you pain. I want to be like the Johnsons. I want to turn off the pain. So Borgel, you has that GLA that likes to turn off pain. So it's an omega-6. It's another type of, it's a cousin of omega-6 that turn off inflammation. Okay? So we're going to make sure that we look at Johnsons. The Borgel, you is like the Johnsons. Thank the Wilsons over here. And I ain't talking bad about the Wilsons because the Wilsons is needed. But Borjoy wants to hang with the Johnsons, okay?